what I did at Christmas. I was going to give a one ounce silver coin to each of my younger cousins. They're 21 and 22 years old. And then I really got thinking about it and I was thinking, well, they may not really realize the value of silver. They may think these are just collector coins or something. So what I decided on doing was giving them some junk silver. I gave them some dimes, quarters, half dollar. And I ended up giving them 95 cents each was their Christmas present. Now I know the one cousin realized that these coins were more valuable than the, you know the face value. The other one, I wasn't. I, I'm not sure what he first thought when he opened up the coins. I had shined up the dimes and quarters, so he thought they were brand new coins. And he looked at the dates and you know 50 year old coins that I was giving him for Christmas. So you know it was, it was interesting. It was an interesting gift, and I hope that you know by giving him the junk silver, maybe they'll realize more the value you know of, of real money you know they can hold real money maybe they've never held real money real silver coins it made me feel good the one cousin that I've talked to about silver you know the past six months he said that just may, may have been what he needed to push to start accumulating a little bit of physical silver so that made me feel good because I've been wanting him to accumulate some physical silver uh, one other thing that we we're talking about at Christmas time was you know wealth and riches and and I was I was saying you know the reason I'm not into precious metals is not to try and become rich it's just to keep what I have from the government and Federal Reserve stealing it through inflation now, I just want to keep what I have I don't, I don't necessarily need to be rich and, and flying around the world and driving fancy cars I mean yeah a lot of people dream about that stuff but you can't take none of that stuff with you and true wealth is is to me is family you know true riches is my wife my children getting together with family at the holidays that's really true wealth that in this life and in my opinion that's true wealth you, the you know the money and having 100 million in the bank there's a lot of people that are have a lot of money that aren't happy I mean what good is all that money if you're not even happy if you're on the verge of suicide or or whatever true wealth really is family I mean in the end what what really is there other than than your family 